Now, assuming you already watched the video on how to set up the Lucy sitting down, looking forward at the subject in this orientation, I'm gonna show you how to use the photo enlarger like this. And it's, it's pretty similar. Um, I left the, uh, the platform attached to the rod here. There's no need to take it back off if you're not putting it away for storage. And then you just attach again the lens by passing the, uh, the male end of the, the rod through there, then threading it in to this filter mount. And it's the filter mount that's out in front of you, um, regardless of which way you turn the head. When you tighten that there, make sure the lens is straight. Um, you can loosen this, this screw up here to make sure that the platform that you're attaching the photograph to is, is uh, straight up and down. Then have a seat, look forward, grab your photograph again with the tape on the back and put it on that platform, move it up and down and around until it's, it's on your paper the way you want it. Stick it, then go ahead and just continue to draw. Draw it the same way you would um, a live object, the same way you drew the last photograph. The uh, only difference here is again, you're flipping, you had flipped the Lucy around to look this way, is now the image is brighter right off the bat and your hand's a little dimmer. Now with the, light, with the good lighting I have in here, just sort of normal studio lighting, I don't need any filter. It looks just fine the way it is. Um, but if the image, if the photograph was too dim, the first thing you wanna do before you start adding filters is making sure that there's not like a shadow cast on your photograph. If there's, um, just cause lighting in the room, the light's maybe coming from this direction and casting a shadow on your photo, that's not gonna work. You need to have light on your, your, on your, on your photo. So make sure you have like maybe a window over your, over your shoulder, a light over your shoulder, something that's making sure that the photo itself is well lit. Cause the filters aren't gonna really do anything if there's not light in the first place. The filters just help um, bring out the brightness, but the light's not there, it's not gonna create more light. And so, um, you can add the filter right here in the filter mount at the bottom, like this to make the image a little brighter. In this instance, I don't need that. If the image is, um, is way too bright, the photograph is so bright you can't see your hand, you can add a, 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 lens, a filter in with the lens right here by taking this back off and then threading the, the uh, shaft through the filter and the lens and attaching that up here. And always hold the filter that you're thinking about attaching first and seeing what makes it better, what makes it worse. And, and right here, it's fine just the way it is. And so I would just, you just draw around the image to have a good sketch and uh, then set aside your Lucy and finish it however you want, just like you would with anything else.